Years later, I got a message that Levon was in the hospital and he was dying. I got on a plane and I went to the hospital. Levon wasn't conscious anymore. His daughter was there and she took me into the room and I, I sat with him and I held his hand and I thought about the amazing times that we had had together. We've been on the front lines of two or three musical revolutions. And now we're just left with these memories. So I sat with my brother and held his hand. And I said, leave on, I'll meet you on the other end. A Virgil Kane is the name, and I served on the Danville train. To Stoneman's cavalry came, and they tore up the tracks again. In the winter of '65, we were hungry, just a valley alive. By May 10, a Richmond had fell. It's a time. Just 18, proud and brave, but a Yankee. 